my people who now go do good do money. My name now Ali Baba. I say make I just wake up this morning, make I greet you now. As on a day this morning, so may God they bless you now. On a banga go ripe. As it be so, on a no go use leg next stone when go cause on a wahala. The stone when on a go kick, na the one when go make on a get better money. You know say them talk say if you use right leg kick something, better they happen. On a left leg no go hit waiting go make on a disturb on herself. And I do greet you now. Una well done. Una they watch this good do good do money show. May God bless all of you now. And una banga go right as I talk. Now Ali Baba make a greet to so. Carry go. Good morning, All right, yes, you welcome back to the Balance Diet Hotel Entertainment this early morning. Now, if you check your Google, you go see say the next bus stop, we don't enter, we don't land, we don't relax on top. Now, another cadre guest will get in the building. Now, this person, now, person we know they knew inside that particular industry, and a person we feature for inside one movie premiere. We're right about now, you go see a few seconds um, after I don't finish the talk. But she also be one of the cast. And as you see, I saw sometimes uh, appearance can be very, very what? Deceptive. But you're going to need to help us make welcome inside the studio this early morning. We'll get Bimbo Ademoye for inside here. Good morning, Bimbo. Good morning. Good morning. How are you doing? I'm yeah, fine. Good morning, Niger. <laughs> you're actually they're very beautiful. Fantastic. I, I think before, before we actually talk about your acting skills, I, you know, they're very good for us to see this movie getting over you, right? Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah, okay, but okay. before we even talk okay. some more now, I, I, I even look at um, the movie industry. We'll not say now for Inside Nigeria, the movie industry is really thriving. Mm -hmm. we, I know so, uh, the, there's a lot of improvement, but so much can still be done. Now, we just talk about tourism with the first mm -hmm. guest we come now. And I discover, say, a lot of movies, they promote tourism. Take, for example, you get so many movies where we know, say, um, we promote tourism, story sites for Inside mm -hmm. That Location. And one of them, now, uh, um, one of the movies now, one movie we were very popular with. One of them is Harry Potter, international movie. Now that one increased tourism by fifty percent into the locations where they actually do. And we get movies like uh, Mission Impossible, where they do two hundred percent increment in terms of people going to Sydney for inside them um, for 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 doing one of the locations where they use. How you feel, say movies for inside our country industries fit to help promote tourism, even if there's a collaboration between these two sectors. Well, clearly we have started um, something yeah. like that because I don't know if you've seen Lost in London by mm -hmm. Udwak Isong. It was shot in mm -hmm. the UK and, you know, they showed um, the beautiful city and all of that. Also, wedding party um, too, Dubai destination, you know, they showed Dubai all around. So I would say, you know, we're moving up. We're definitely moving forward when it comes to that aspect. As the day goes by, we're just thriving in that aspect. But those locations where you mentioned, they're outside Nigeria. Okay. We they talk of for the Nigerian for the Nigerian movie production in terms oh, of yeah, shooting. Sure. In mm -hmm. certain locations okay. in Nigeria, we go help mm -hmm. promote tourism. Absolutely. Um, um, I mean, song's movie, Ayama, I think it was shot in Akwai Bomb. Um, it was shot in, uh, you, you know, the, the city was also shown. In, the, the movies that are being shot in Calabar, Abelkuta, Ondo State, and all of that. And I think they, they do show, like, the city in a very, like, in very beautiful um, places like that. Yeah, you know, I remember one of home. MME song um, mm -hmm. um, movie actually promote the rich culture of Benin. Exactly. And um, then when she won premiere, she got to bring people down mm -hmm. um, to Benin. Yes. So yeah, it was really at. fantastic. But we need to still do more Definitely. to promote um, tourism. Definitely. Now let's talk about sexual harassment in the movie industry. Now not just in Nigeria. We know say um, international in America now it's like the talk of the day, um, sexual harassment in Hollywood. What about, um, what about Nollywood, sorry, in Hollywood? What about Nollywood? Well, I can speak for myself. I haven't experienced sexual harassment before, maybe because, um, you know, the wings I grew under, which is Udwak Isong's wings, you know, she's, you know, she came on like a more than, more than a producer. So I don't, I don't, I, I've heard of it, but it has never come to my direction before. So I really cannot relate. But, you know, I've heard that it's happening and, you know, I hope that, something is being done about it. But as for me, I've never experienced something like that before. Okay, maybe we'll look even um, now we movie premiere, a lot of premieres, they come out in terms of um, um, movie production for Inside Nigeria. A lot of times, before this movie even reached cinema for mm -hmm. private screening, right. Alaba International, don't get 50,000. <sighs> before Privacy. the actor or the cast 
go get the money. They go only blow first when inter inside international, Alaba international market. What do you feel, say, the government fit to, to discourage this? Even though we know, say, that piracy, they also make them blow facially, mm -hmm. just in the pages. When it comes to the money or the hard work we don't put inside them, they know they get that credit. What if, which kind of collaboration you feel, say, the government fit do with those people for inside the industry? Point blank period. This might sound very brutal, but I feel like the government should just, like, Put a law that anybody who is saying selling something, uh, the law item, is already on ground. They should be arrested. The law is on ground. Then, already. then, are they being arrested? Oh yes, they get one. Yes, they get situations like that. I, I will talk about Lagos State. Okay. I, I know, sir, the Lagos State government they do a lot of um, work to make sure that they come out piracy um, permanently for inside Lagos State. I don't see a couple of times whereby Funke Akidele go market and she say our movies are being pirated mm -hmm. and then she go report immediately and. They, they, remember one time we trained and they again. arrest them. And I think say, it's more than even the government. Even we too, we have a role to play. Exactly. When we see these people pirating copies, we never even enter inside cinema or they never start to even um, sell them. We should report and um, we need our um, police uh, force to take action Absolutely. On I think Nigerians too should help in the sense yeah. that you... S I've seen my movie in the cinema, um, on the streets before, and it wasn't out in the cinema yet. Yeah. Like, I saw somebody buy and I wish I could just tell her, like, don't, don't yeah, worry about it. You know, we buy it. Well, then again, you know, like, that's another thing. Exactly. We buy it. Yeah, You're but if you look, if you look at them now, these, these movies are being leaked that by people where they work for inside the production, part of the production team. Because an Alaba person, if you just come inside, decide to steal that movie, if we don't exactly. get a perpetrator where they're in the midst of the circle. So Very really, true. we need to screen the kind of people who they bring on, 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 on board in terms of doing true. that. Because now then they go back and leak them. And also, we have people. a role to play, like you talk. Um, um, we, we need to stop to the patronize this people. Absolutely. If we keep on patronizing them, they will keep on, they do the pirated copies. But when they see, say, come, money not they come from this again, no, they will come out for inside that mm -hmm. area. Very but true. I want us to be very interested, or rather, I'm going to talk based on the movie where the trend now, because our girl is inside all everybody. <laughs> now, let's talk about getting over here. Wow. If you don't see my name, they don't even stop. They're just continue, continue, continue. Like, seriously. 26, don't worry. 26 is almost here. Ah, that's nice. <laughs> Tell us your role. Because now, seeing the movie, I see, say, there was a particular guy. Mm -hmm. Do you hear me? <laughs> Why should we read the details of the movie? Was playing, no, no, no. no. I, I, don't, I, don't, don't release too much, but I just want to know. That, that a particular guy was playing both um, ladies inside the movie. How was it like for you to fit into that role of being one of the girls? Hmm. Well, <laughs> it wasn't it wasn't easy. It wasn't tough either ways. But being the other girl, where somebody would like that, oh, is my twin mm -hmm. brother, or as you you saw in the trailer, now my twin brother at the daytime was something like that. I was pained in real life as an individual. Like, mm -hmm. let me nab this individual. Like, what? The? <laughs> because, like, it happens every day. I know. You see it on I Twitter. Think you see the it? other girl. Never. I hope not. <laughs> because you would never know. You, like, exactly. like if you're just going to, you know, Facebook or something, <laughs> and then you see your boyfriend that said he's coming, he's getting married. Like, ah, ah, when, when, how, yeah, why? I mean, like, you know the fear God, like, what is that? You know, so I just hope I'm not the other girl. Ah, I yeah, but you know, it, it, it happened even both ways. A lot yeah. of times, so a lot of girls, they don't, they don't want to just, um, it's, a, it's a risky business, and people yeah, don't, don't want to just... Yeah, don't put your eggs in yeah, one basket. Oh, you know what I'm saying? You just spray the tentacles in the should we, should we really not put our eggs in one basket? Uh, Have you really been putting all your eggs in one basket? If you get past because... one crate, put your egg go. <laughs> all right, she don't talk her, she don't drop that one now. I'm gonna need to ask you this next question now, really, because yeah. I know say for a lot of a lot of actors, it's not so easy putting themselves in the role of the of the particular character. Mm -hmm. So for you, is it a psychological thing where they do before you go in to do that role? Definitely. Or how you they take how you they take and prepare yourself for the character? Well, when I get roles like, you know, this getting over him, um, um, the one I played in getting over him, it's like, it's something that happens every day. So mm -hmm. roles like that, they're actually easy. You know, you could just surf the internet, read on things like that, and you know, how to become that person. You take off the person that you are to become someone else. And but when I get roles that like are emotional, like true life stories, like telling other people's stories, then like I'm on my script 247 on the internet because this thing happened to someone. And if I don't let the person happen to feel like, wow, thank you for telling my story. Like, 
I don't feel complete. So it, it, it depends on what type of character it is. All these get me vibe characters, it happens every day. Like now, so for this intense character, how do they take maintain your own identity at the end of the day? Because like you talk, some mm -hmm. characters they intensive way. Right. At some point you have to put, try to pull yourself. And it's it's not just a physical level thing. It's something it's, it's psychological for some people. It's emotional. How right. do they take maintain your own identity at the end of the day? Your own true self, separating it when <sighs> the time comes. How? Bimbo is tough. Oh. I don't think I don't think can change. You know, when I finish, I come out and I become Bimbo again. Wow. Obviously, I can see you. <laughs> tough person. I can you see know. it. I can see Very it in tough. you. <laughs> so, you so, how long does production be take? Because I know enough for inside Nigeria, Lagos, yeah, yeah, yes, So, how long does yes. production be take? Well, uh, pre production, I really can't say. Production, the um, filming, everything was done in uh, about uh, a week and some days. Wow. Yes. Less than two weeks. Less than That's two nice. weeks. That's now, looking at the title of the movie, Getting Over Him, you go not say yes, it's like a process of getting over a person where you don't break your heart. The fall of a Yoruba demon. The fall of a Yoruba the demon. We now bring them back. down. When they talk, say devil. We bring them down. <laughs> now, when you're on Edo, Edo side. No, you see, the thing is, uh, it's was, not, it's not, it doesn't really have to do with tribes. just that, you know, that Yoruba is more like, um, it's like a title. Whether you you're Igbo or not Yoruba demon. demon. You and this movie yeah? is about yes. the fall of every Yoruba demon. The fall of Flat. everybody where it gets three <laughs> girls and then you say now you're, now you're brother, girlfriend, and this one, girlfriend. We'll deal with now, let's you. take it personal. We're so we. passionate. Did I ever say wow. I've broken before? Who hasn't? Never so, when eh? tell us the process of getting over him. Hmm. I would have told you, but if I tell you, you will not see the secret in the movie. So, on the 26th of January, <laughs> you go and watch him. How, how you take a get over him? How you take get over that heartbreak? I did it in the it. movie, so you can watch it. Oh, you did it in the movie? Yes. Exactly. She got, <laughs> okay, so uh, exactly. Did you say January 26th, 1990? Yeah, Shelley. Across all the cinemas for the years? Or? Well, I'm certain about um, Silver Wand and um, I hope Silver Bed, but those two definitely, Nikeja and Surulay. Uh, how, what time the, on the 26th? Well, the information will be out will before, be out before soon. the 26th. Everyone. Now, t tell us how, uh, working with Udwak um, Isong, tell us how the working condition be. Working with Udwak Isong is like working with my mother. So you know how sweet it can be when you're getting paid to work with your mother. It's just like she's a mother to everybody. She's a mother of all. Like She makes you feel comfortable. She like Her scripts always, always, always make sense. That's why she has movies hits back to back. And this is the TV. <laughs> I know what it's like working with our our special girl here, Olive. Olive, Olive uh, first of all, I love Olive's voice. Ah, <laughs> she has a very nice. <laughs> she has Olive is Olive is a sweetheart. Everybody Aww. loves Olive. Like, you know, like I said, working with Udwak is like working with your mother, and it was like a you know a family situation. So Olive was like new to the family, and you know. Yeah. You know, you can be jealous when somebody new comes to the family. Yeah, yeah. I, know, yeah. I, know. I mean, Everybody's like, everybody attention. was just like, come okay. here, where have you been, sister? Like, get over here. So it was just really it nice working nice. with her. I can't wait to see the movie. And I, I know cannot get wait a lot for of you to see Talented, it. brilliant yeah. actors. Oh, yes, there's Dayemi O'Connor, there's Bimbo Adimo. Yeah, there's Olive Imodi, there's Majid Michelle, there's Matilda Obaseki. There's, you know, a lot of... All right, and definitely yeah. we all go go to that cinema come January 26th to so go watch yeah. the movie, Getting Over Him. him but I need your... Um, yeah, not saying a lot of people get a lot of questions to ask you, especially okay. as time don't be on our side. So right. which of the social media handles you get to show people? I'm on Instagram, Bimbo Ademwe on Instagram. Are Bimbo you searching? Ademwe, one Are you year. searching? Because I want one, them to send the application. Year, Are you searching? I bet it's send with sense, so... So your yeah, <laughs> SS She's first. At this point in time, it's SSS officially. <laughs> single, um, Bimbo Ade. single. Single and seriously searching, baby. Oh, it's not serious, though. Uh, hey, it's just single and searching. It's just serious. That's just serious is on a higher level. It's on the higher It's not that serious. I'm not something. Okay. Serious I just is not serious. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for coming to this one. Thank you. you. A wonderful interview we'll be get with you. you. So lovely. We're always here to support you. And we're looking mm -hmm. forward to your next role. Yeah, oh, I fantastic. wish you all the best all in the movie industry. I see a lot of much. talent in you. Oh a lot of talent. And you're going places, darling. See, she's the same market. She's even acting here. She's the same market now. All right, that's all we'll see on today, this morning, on Top of the Balance Diet Hotel Entertainment. We'll go there again tomorrow to give you a very better recap of everything we're not sharing from Monday, go reach today, but by tomorrow to be yesterday. See you. <laughs> I feel so anything where you get passion for, you need to start today to well. So now wait till I tell you them this morning. My name is Ruman Uvi Ehi Gamusoy. Have a wonderful day, people. Not leaving peace and pieces. I'll tell them tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. That was very nice. To enjoy more of this our Ubonke videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.